Hey beauty queens, welcome back. So we are doing a review on the Ronnie Hair 360 um lace wig. This is 18 inches um body wave texture. Um, we did like a cute little messy updo with this. I had a lot of fun with this. Um, the lace is actually transparent lace. It's not HD. So here I'm just going to show you guys how we get our foundation done. Um, when I do the braids, I braid all of the braids going up. Um, so that you don't have, you know, it's, it's just easier to lay the wig down. You don't want anything on the neck. So this is how it should look. Now we actually put the wig on. I'll show you guys how it looks before we start gluing it down. Um, it does have tracks in the middle of this wig. So you cannot like do any other versatile versatility styles. Um, you can put it up. You could put it down. Um, but it's like I said, this is transparent lace. And look how it's looking. I did have to tint the lace. Um, I always use concealer. I don't use any specific. Yeah, you know, I mean, I don't use any lace tint. Um, my secret method is concealer. It's been working. And you know what they say. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. So I will continue to use that until I find a product that I like that's worth me switching. Um, but yes. So we're going to go ahead with our beauty bond. And we're going to lay down. Um, we're going to lay the lace glue. You know, you do it in thin layers. Um, I usually do like about three or four layers. Um, but yeah, so we laid that down. Now it's time to get this on. I always lay the front first and then after the front is laid down, you could go ahead and lay the back down. So I'm doing the same process in the back that I do for the front. Um, you're just going to apply even layers across the whole entire back, just like you did the front. However many layers you usually do, like I said, me, I usually do about three or four because afterwards I go back in and I add another layer. Um, but you're going to do it the same way you would do the front hairline. So I was having a little bit of difficulties with this video because my phone kept on saying my storage was full and it kept cutting the videos off and I didn't know that it wasn't recording. So I'm sorry you guys didn't get to see me actually lay that down. Um, but I laid it down and now I'm tying my band on so that I can't get it stuck. You know, you add the pressure so that you can get it stuck. And now um, we let it sit for, I let it sit probably for about like six minutes and now I took it off. Um, you can go ahead and we're going to cut off our excess lace now.
Look at this, y'all. Look at how it's looking. It's so flat. It's so neat. But that's not it. We got to go back in and we got to tie this down again. Because you want it to be melted. You want it to be on. You want it to be stuck. But as you can see, I'm pulling it. I'm, you know, twisting it. I'm doing all of this stuff. And it's not lifting. So I tied the band from back to front because it allows you to get the whole back um, and the front without you having to put multiple bands on to keep it slick. I mean, to keep it um, pressed up against the glue. Um, that works for me. And look, look at how natural it looks. I'm going to pull it down for y'all so y'all can see. But I really was surprised, honestly, from how... It looked so natural, but the trick is you can pretty much use any lace as long as the lace either is for light-skinned people lighter than their complexion, never darker. And for dark skin, you can kind of use almost any lace as long as you can tint it dark. And as long as you use a tint that matches them perfectly, you're always going to get a final result as long as you, you know, especially if you know how to install lace. So don't ever get discouraged if you don't have HD lace. It's just that that lace is the thinnest, um, you know, and it tends to just be a lot of um, less work that you have to put in to make it look like it's really, really natural. But like I said, this is transparent lace. It is not HD lace. So I'm like, you know what? Instead of us doing like a regular style, let's do something cute. Let's do something fun. And this does not take long at all. So we're going to do our messy little updo. I'm sectioning off the front part um, that I'm going to have out. I'm going to curl that piece. So I just need to get it sectioned out. And then I'm going to just do some loose curls on the back and add some like messy little curls falling. It's going to be cute. Y'all saw it. I love doing different styles like that. You know, it's, it's like this, rather. 
you know, just get you to do something different. You know, everybody wants their straight middle part with curls, straight side part with curls, curly hair side part. Everything is like that. Like, I love doing stuff like this. I'm going to start bringing y'all more videos where, you know, the wigs are styled into different styles. The next video I'm doing, I'm super excited about it. I can't wait for you guys to see that. But, yeah, back to this look. So, I curled the, you know, I did some, like, loose curls just so that it can fall with curls even when I'm pulling it out. And um, when you curl it, it just allows you to, you know, play with a little bit. And even if, you know, so it just doesn't look blah and, you know, with no volume. So, now I'm just going to curl my front. And then we're going to be all done after that. After we curl the front. That's it. This is easy. Um, I did this install in less than two hours or probably about two hours. Um, it did not take long at all. I customized it beforehand. I did have to pluck. I did have to bleach the knots. I did have to tint the lace. Um, but that's fine. You know, if you want it to be as natural as possible and you want it to blend with your client's skin, you're going to do all of that, you know? So, yes, it was it was fun. This is Beauty by Day and Ronnie hair. This is their 18-inch 360 wig um, body wave texture. You can use the cold day to get money off. Who don't like a discount? Tell them they sent you. And follow me on Instagram. You can follow them on Instagram. Visit the website. Use the discount code. You know I will be back with more reviews, more videos, more tutorials. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys soon. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Sorry. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys don't know when I got a new video. So y'all can get, you know, let's get it together.